Okay. Um, you all have known that this uh okay, we we come back to this one. Can I show from current this? Okay, you have seen this uh, presentation already, right? Um, this is the case for the DP, rational DP curve, right? And um, if you want to calculate for the point on the Bayesian curve or rational Bayesian curve, you can use DP curve instead, okay? And previously I've talked about side ball and long ball, right? So my assignment to ask you all to do is um, um, you can follow this uh, the step in this paper, in this presentation, by converting from Bayesian to side ball or Bayesian to Wang ball, and then you calculate, try to calculate for the rational Wang ball or rational side ball, right? And um, it's supposed to be faster, right, than computing the point on the rational Bayesian control points alone, right? So I will ask you, because we have side by and normal and we are, there are two students here today, right? I will ask you to, to do the same thing, right? To find this. This table, right? Okay, you can see in this table, this is a, the castle draw algorithm in order to compute for the rational Bayesian curve. And I want you to find the algorithm in order to find the number of addition and multiplication for side ball and wrong ball curve. Okay. Try to find n from three to 15 or more if you can find the, 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 the calculation. This is the, this is the assignment, mm -hmm. the homework, and you can submit me next, next Thursday. Oh my God, <sighs> next Thursday. Okay, this one, I will stop this recording.